Hello everyone. In JavaScript, how we can clone a object? Firstly, I have this constructor function, and what I will do is create an object using that, and say constant. Uh, let's say person one is equals to new person, and also I need to provide some arguments for that name and page okay now I need to clone this one in JavaScript we can do that in several ways okay in modern JavaScript we use object dot assign operator object dot assign using this we can copy all properties and methods of an object to a new object. Let me go ahead and show you. In parentheses, firstly we have to provide an uh, object, the target object. It can be an empty one or it can be an uh, object that has properties and methods. And we can provide the source object. Source object let's write as person1. Now what happened, all uh, properties and methods will copy to this new object or it can be an object that already has properties like salary, say, and this one and also say job, engineer, like that. Finally what we had to do assign this code to a new constant or variable we can say const let's say person 2 equals to object dot assign now what happens every properties and methods will copy to the this new object which already had some more properties salary and job and we can access that object let's say console dot log in the parentheses, I'm going to say person2. Now let's open our terminal and run the JavaScript using the node. You can say node index.js. Now we can see this object has uh, more properties salary, job, and also these properties name, age, and the save method. Okay? Now let's go ahead and remove these properties and just keep the empty object. And we can run that. Now we only have these properties. One thing to note here that you can provide more arguments as objects. It can be uh, multiple objects like source 2 and source 3 and so on. We can create a new object to ensure that it works. I'm going to close this and let's copy this function, the constructor function, and paste that here. Instead, person, we can say like job. We need some arguments, let's say type and salary. This dot type is equals to type, and this dot salary. It goes to salary. Okay. We don't need this save method. Instead, we can say uh, create job. That's fine. Job saved as the message. Now we can provide that constructor function to create the object. Say const job one is equals to new job in the parentheses the type is engineer and the salary let's say this one fine now as the argument for this object dot assign we can say job one now let's go ahead and run that again we can say not index.js now we got name, age, 
and the save method available in this person uh, constructor function and the uh, type salary and create job properties and methods available on this job constructor function okay now there's another way to do this thing copy a object to a another object this object dot assign can be used to copy a single object or multiple objects into a single object which can also have properties existing on that the next way we are going to look for is using the spread operator to clone a object to a another object let's go ahead and comment these out why did you do that and this one also what I will do, just go for creating a new object. We can say constant, let's say person1 is equal to new person. In the parentheses, we have to write arguments, name and the age. Let's say 24. Okay. Now, as I told you, to clone an object using the spread operator, we only have to say Let's say creating a new one, person2 is equals to, we have to provide braces. In the braces, put three dots. Okay. And this is the spread operator. And in the right side, we have to provide the source object, which can be person1. Now, what happened here is all properties and methods will copy it inside of this braces that means all properties and methods available inside this braces now we can console.log the person to object let's say not index.js now we can see that contains these properties and also the method save method this one okay also finally you can use for loop with the in operator to copy each and every property and methods in an object to a another object i hope this video helps if this video helps please subscribe thank you